how much protection to the gun owners will that sec will that Second Amendment sanctuary? How much protection will that give us? Well, I would I uh, I happen to think that sanctuary cities for the Second Amendment are all cities. Uh, the Second Amendment is the Constitution. It is a constitutionally protected right. So when, you know, with sanctuary cities with illegals, that's like, uh, yeah, we're not going to enforce the law because we disagree with it. This is, we are going to enforce the law. Uh, it will all come down to your sheriffs. If you have a really good sheriff, um, the sheriff does not answer to the governor, does he? I'm trying to remember, Pat. In the Constitution, I think sheriffs are the only ones that don't that don't have a hierarchy. They answer to the people. I'm not sure I know the sheriff hierarchy. A lot is up on the hierarchy of sheriffdom, right? As it should be. I'm pretty the sure it is definitely me. I, whether yeah. I, it's never know. been right. What I know of, never been tested. Right. But the but the idea is is that the sheriff is not an appointment uh, from anybody and doesn't answer to anybody but the people. And that's why yeah. the counties are doing it, because the county sheriff, if you have a good one, is saying, that's my constitutional right. I respond to the people, not to the governor or anybody else. But you will have a fight uh, between the sheriff and uh, the governor. That's why you need to be, uh, all Americans should pay very close attention to who they have as their, as their sheriff. And make sure you really know that person and that person understands the Constitution and will stand. Thanks so much, Ethan. Hope that helps uh, answer your question. You should also be very much aware of the presidential candidate most likely uh, to do something about this gun situation, and that's Michael Bloomberg, mm. of course. He wants, to, he wants to take the guns off the streets, which is great. And... Uh, <laughs> And I think, well, which is great, right, to take the guns off of the streets. If yeah. they were just laying there in the streets, yeah, well, I, I was like, you know, can somebody pick these up? My, well, my issue yeah. is it's a tire hazard. I'm constantly You're driving right. tires because of all the guns on the, on the right. streets. Yeah. Right. Right. Yeah. Right. And then they but go sure. off just by themselves. Especially those bayonets, right? Because yeah. they're always on the end of yeah. the guns. And, they yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. and then just in case the same thing happens at home, he's going to come and get them out of your house, too. Right. Just to right. make everything really oh, safe. Right. Right. Obviously. Yeah. There's no reason to have something that was developed specifically. Specifically to kill. This is this is one of the. I mean, remember, this is the guy who, what, over the weekend said, "No, President Z is not a dictator. He, he answers to his constituency. Yeah. Yeah. No, he changed the law so he doesn't answer to any."